In Colorado, one person was killed and a dozen others had to be rescued from a tourist mine. Investigators say they became trapped 1,000 feet underground when the elevator malfunctioned. ABC's Melissa Adan has the story. A daring rescue deep inside a Colorado gold mine after nearly two dozen people were trapped 1,000 feet below. And here's the good news. 45 minutes ago, we were able to get the last person out of the 1,000 foot level of the mine. Teller County officials say the elevator that takes visitors to the base malfunctioned at the Molly Kathleen gold mine, killing one person. 11 people, including children, were pulled to safety early on, but a dozen visitors stranded at the base of the tourist destination for six hours. Officials say the tour guide, a local father, 46-year-old Patrick Weir, was killed in the mining accident. All I know that he was a good man and uh, he loved his job and he was a part of a mine safety crew and he, he'd done different things. He'd just gotten done with a fire academy. For us and what it looks like that he may have been a, a hero. The gold mine has existed since the late 1800s and became a tourist attraction in the 60s, attracting tourists during its mine tour season, which runs from May through mid-October. I will tell you the owner of this mine uh, and the family that have been behind this mine for many, many years have done a great job of making everything safe. They put thousands of people and thousands of people down this mine um, for tours and with very, very low uh, safety concerns. Engineers were able to repair the elevator stuck at about 500 feet and then run cables up and down so rescuers could save the trapped people. OSHA, the Occupational Safety and Health Administration, is now investigating what went wrong and caused the elevator to malfunction. As for the tourists who were rescued, they were checked out by medical staff. Four people had minor injuries. Melissa Adan, ABC News, Los Angeles.